folks i've got another unboxing for you today today's unboxing is of little live pets kitten so i found the instructions for this folks so i'll get out the box we'll have a quick look at it and then we'll have a look at the instructions So here's the kitten folks, it feels quite heavy so I think maybe they've included batteries in it. Here's the cute little kitty, it's a bit dirty, it's another candidate for the old isopropyl alcohol, I might keep its original name which was Lily. I got this kitten for a very good price off eBay. It was just £18.20, including shipping. So, folks, before we move on, let's have a look at the instructions. So, Cuddles came out in 2017, five years ago now. It originally came with a bowl, but I haven't got the bowl I don't know if there was a magnet in the bowl or not, but I'll have to investigate that. So it says, feed me from my bowl. I nuzzle like a real kitten and my tail moves. I twirl my tail when you pat me. I close my eyes and make sleeping sounds. So we've got a diagram now. Interestingly, the picture of the bowl seems to be pointing to some circle on it. I, I'm really am wondering if there's a magnet on it. And then we have a diagram of the kitten showing where the sensors are. So it's got a touch sensor on its back. It's got touch sensors on both of its cheeks. And then it says a muzzle button which would suggest that there's n it's not uh, like a reed switch activated by a magnet. We'll, we'll have to test that out. It shows the battery compartments in both of the rear legs. And there's a slide switch on one of the paw pads on the back leg that has three positions on, off and try me. It also has... An arrow pointing to the tail because the tail it says needs to be clicked into position um, once you take the kitten out of the packaging so it requires four triple a batteries and you put two of those batteries into each back leg so this tail actually, um, it must have been locked into its correct position and um, it actually does move the tail mechanically. In fact, it's got a lot of movement altogether. The eyes and the head move, makes various sounds. So let's try putting it on on and see if it has got batteries inside. Yes, it has. I thought it was quite heavy. Definitely wants a clean up. <laughs> the um, meows are not very realistic on it. And the motors are surprisingly noisy for a modern toy. It's very slow in its movements. I'm wondering if the batteries are low on charge it might be worth putting some fresh batteries in and seeing if uh, notice any difference so i've got the fresh batteries in let's see if they make any difference yeah it's a bit snappier so we're in action with the batteries now so Let's have another look at the instructions and see what this kitten does. I love attention and every so often I will cry out and ask for one of the following. Feeding, 
cuddling, sleeping and back petting. If you tend to me, I'll reward you with a secret praise. Attention mode. If you leave me in the sitting position or lying on my stomach, I will occasionally cry out for your attention. So I take it that that's the kitten asking for attention. Yeah. <laughs> I quite like that uh, movement of the tail. If you don't do anything, I will eventually get tired and fall asleep. So the kitten's closed its eyes now because I haven't been interacting with it. And I think that uh, noise must mean that it's actually gone to sleep now. Please feed me. I can get very hungry when I play with you. To feed me, gently push my muzzle against the bowl. While in this position, you'll hear me drinking. Release and I'll sound satisfied. So let's see if this is a button on the muzzle. Yes, I can feel. Yeah, you can feel it's a button. <laughs> Wasn't expecting that. So yeah, you don't need any special bowl for it. So you could use any replacement bowl because it's just um, actually um, pressing that switch down uh, on a hard surface. That's uh, what you do to get it to lap its milk. Stroke either of my cheeks and I'll close my eyes and nuzzle into you. Stroke me to make me purr contentedly. When you remove your hand, I'll make happy sounds. So I'm going to try stroking the cheeks now. Yeah, so it purrs and uh, wanks its tail and turns its head towards the side that you're stroking. Not a bad purr. The way it turns its head towards the side you're stroking is just like the furry old friend's cat. Time to sleep. Playing with you can tire me out. Sometimes I need a little nap. To put me to sleep, lay me down on my back or my side. I will fall asleep and occasionally snore and wag my tail when on my side. So I'm going to lay the kitty on its side. Wow, it goes to sleep straight away. Makes this sort of heavy breathing sound. Oh, look at the tail. <laughs> And snores. Um, it was uh, amazingly quick the reaction that when you put it on its side. So it's obviously got some sort of tilt sensor as well, though that's not mentioned in the diagram and it goes over the different sensors it has. back. When I'm not sleeping, 
I love to be petted. Gently stroke the centre of my back. Watch my tail wag. I'll purr contentedly and make happy sounds when you release your hand. So put the kitty. That's woken up straight away now. So when you stroke the back, you get that wagging tail and purring. Also noticed if it does go to sleep, if you press the mouth button, oh, that'll nice. wake it up. Mm -hmm. <laughs> wind again <laughs> what do you think of um, this edition Paul I like it it's another quality uh, for real no it wasn't for real it was by Moose Toys oh right in the Little Live Little pet Live you know range. I just thought I thought it was for real mm. it's it's very much like um, the old for real isn't it it is yeah it's not like um, what they've been making recently. No, it's like, it's like toys. No, it's it, this is like the old for real range as well, isn't yeah, it? Where you've got yeah. like realism, some yeah. good animation. Mm. Um, so, given the experience of the sort of pseudo pet, mm, which was mm. what for real was all about when it That's first. That's right, mm. and, and this up. does a lot as well. I've noticed you, yeah. you've got it to lie down and go to sleep. It's got tail movement, good head movement, eye movement. Yeah, it's. Uh, it's good, and uh, yes, I thought it was for real, but moose. Yeah, mm. yeah, moose, little live pets. <laughs> <laughs> it's got a lot of positions you can put it in, so you yeah. can sit it up, you can have it on its chest like that. And, uh... <laughs> it doesn't seem to want to be laid down like that, Paul. <laughs> love that tail. You know, the tail's really good, because mm. um, you don't often get moving tails. You don't, do you? No. On uh, no. animatronic models. Good to sleep, yeah. Mm, I like that. It's very, that's quite relaxing. It is, isn't it? I mean, it's yeah. not realistic, this sort of heavy breathing, but it's quite quite soothing. Little Live have not brought out uh, anything as big as this before, have they? Um, they brought out the kitten and they brought out a puppy right. that was the same size. Okay. Um, but I, no, I don't think they, they have brought anything else out apart from the... Um, puppy and the kitten that are this size. Mm. Yeah, it's, it's nice for a toy. That is nice bit of anima animation, isn't mm. it? Mm. I think not even just for a toy. Mm. To mm. get that sort of mm. wag in the tail would be nice mm -hmm. on mm -hmm. any model. Mm. Looking forward to seeing it cleaned up. I haven't unlocked any of these um, phrases that it makes yet. Yeah, you've not been attentive enough I'm to not being attentive. Oh! <laughs> Must have heard me. Yeah. Oh, that for timing. <laughs> Brilliant. So I don't know if that's the the only phrase that it makes. Mm, we'll find out. Mm, over time. So, folks, I hope you've enjoyed this unboxing and demonstration of the little live cuddles kitten. And I will be doing a cleaning up video very soon. Should be particularly dramatic with it being all white fur, mm. as it was with the um, butterscotch. Yeah, the pony. Mm. But that's it for this video, folks. Thanks for watching, as always. And see you next time.